Evening, everybody. It's uh, Joe here again from Data Analytics Ireland. It is the Tuesday, the 19th of May, 2020. Hope you're keeping well. Very, very, very quick video today. It's very, very straightforward thing you want to go run by people and show them how to do in OR. So if you are of a file and you basically want to see if it exists first and basically if there's anything inside it, very quick way to do this. I'm going to show it to you straight away here. So the file we want to check for is empty file a.txt. So what I'm going to do is check to see number one in logic, does it exist? Number two, is there anything inside it? So immediately I know that it's zero bytes here. So I know this, it's empty, but need to be sure to the code. So just take it through quickly the logic for this. So the first thing you want to do is you want to set the wor set working directory. And all that's basically doing is telling the program here in OR, your project, that um, the working directory, where everything, the project files, the actual file you want to check and everything, that's where it's stored. So it means you don't have to put the the path in each every time here into file.size or file.exists. It just knows to go into there and check it in that folder. So that's what that steps for. Next thing we want to do is actually check is the main check piece of logic this video is about. So two things we want to do is check for file exists and file size. And file size, file exists, just checking is the file there. And file size is greater than zero. That basically means is there anything inside it. Now one thing to think to be conscious of is is if statement, it's checking for both. So if both conditions aren't met and are true, it will throw out an error and say it's not true and basically it should give us this back. So basically, if it's true, it's going to say file exists and is not empty. If it's false, it's basically going to say check, please check file information. So I'm just going to run this here now. So please check file information, um, which is correct. Now, you're probably wondering why this is correct because of the file over here. But the reason it's failed, because I don't have the A at the end here. So if I put the A here, okay, put the A here. All right. I'm just going to save that. It's still going to give me, when I run it, I'll just run that again anyway, just to show you, but it's still going to give me, uh, please check file information. And the reason being, it's now satisfying this condition, but it's not satisfying this condition because it's still at zero. So what I'm going to do is just basically type in this and save. Okay, so now the file, it's 22 bytes, I'll just close this. The file, the file is now obviously this correct file name and it has information inside it and it's 22 bytes. So when I run this again, it's now recognized the fact the file is there and also that it's not empty. So that's a very quick tutorial there in OR and how to check to see if a file exists within a folder and to see if there's any data contained within it. I hope you like it. Give us a big uh, thumbs up, uh, follow us on Twitter, Facebook. Please uh, subscribe to our channel on YouTube. We much appreciate it. Um, plenty more videos coming in the OR. We're trying to build on some of the videos that I did on the Python series as well. So hopefully be able to replicate some of that logic that I wrote in Python here in OR. Catch you soon. Have a great day. And thanks for joining us to watch this video.